Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, do not adjust your monitor. Yes, indeed! It is that time again. Time for a Deltray upload video, and today we have to <laughs> do a little bit of a channel update, I think. It has been quite some time, guys. It has been, <laughs> wow, way too long. Almost six months. Six months! Happy year, guys. That's insane to me. So, <laughs> what happened, right? Uh, first of all, though, before even getting into that, I did want to offer an apology for this video even taking as long <laughs> as it has, to be honest with you guys. Um... Uh, there's really not a whole lot of excuse for that on my part. I should have most certainly been more uh, open, more upfront, more clear about what was going on and why there's been such a large delay in uploads. Uh, <laughs> let me say this though, uh, it was never intended to be this long, but regardless of that, uh, I do take responsibility for lack of transparency and I do want to apologize. Believe me guys, it's not lost on me. Uh, <laughs> I've seen a lot of the comments that I'm still getting to this day. Uh, saying, you know, I, w I wish this guy would come back. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're fine. Uh, I'm fine. L let me be clear about that as well. I'm doing perfectly okay. Uh, the love and support was very much appreciated. I, I I don't know how else to really quantify that other than to say thank you. And believe me, it really meant a lot. It really did mean a lot during this time where I have been sort of away. It was very comforting to see people still giving support even though I wasn't able to necessarily uphold my end of the obligation, which I, I, I do feel bad for, guys. I'm sorry, I, I understand what it's like to get invested in something and then have it just go away. So I, I, I feel bad about that. I genuinely do. And I wanted to sincerely thank each and every person who has stu stuck with it so far and who is watching this video right now. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. Now, what happened? <laughs> Well, to be honest, uh, initially I quit recording due to personal issues in my own life, and that's that's just kind of where it stands on that. I had noticed a zip in quality in some of the more recent videos that I had made, and uh, it wasn't just something that only I had noticed, too. It, it was something that uh, actually uh, Mangs had pointed it out when I did the live stream with him and Mecha for the last part of his Path of Radiance Let's Play. He had... Uh, in a later video, he had mentioned that I seemed kind of quiet and kind of out of it, which is true. I was That was kind of during the brunt of everything that was going on. So it, it was affecting it was affecting this. It was affecting what I was doing. And it wasn't just him either. Um, there was also the video that I did for the Fire Emblem E3 conference. <laughs> conference, I make it sound so official. <laughs> but the Fire Emblem E3 video I did, I had also seen some people who were saying... Uh, that, they weren't saying necessarily anything about me, but they were using my disposition during that video to go on and say, Oh, well, look, if Deltray's not happy with this, if he's not his happy, cheery self, this must be a trash ROM hack or something like that. And I'm paraphrasing. They didn't say it like that. But they were using my words and the way that I was portraying myself in a video to sort of go after something totally unrelated, this, this ROM hack that I had did a presentation on. So I said to myself, okay, clearly, clearly I'm not 100% right now, I need to take a break. A few weeks later, you may recall, <laughs> if you're uh, deep into the Fire Emblem community and all that, you may have noticed that I recorded with Mecha and Marky Joe, we did that video, <laughs> The Heroes of Horrors, and I sounded a lot better. So I was going to come back, you know, just pick up the Let's Plays where we left them off, essentially. Unfortunately, <laughs> and this is where it gets fun. Uh, my hard drive, right? My hard drive failure. I think everybody saw it coming, especially with uh, with what had happened previously, where I had lost Berwick saves, I had lost Thracia saves, and all that good stuff. Now, the good news is I have learned from that lesson, and I do have backup saves for every playthrough that we were doing so far, so I can jump back in as if nothing ever happened. Regardless of that, though, if I'm being perfectly honest, it, it didn't really matter at that point because... This happening, this, this hard drive failure, this made me mad. This made me absolutely livid to the point that I didn't even really want to look at YouTube or really acknowledge it at all. I, I, I know that sounds probably pretty horrible, but that's just kind of like a defense mechanism of sorts, if you will. Not a great coping method, I am fully aware, but in my mind, it was it was like trying to distance myself from it so that I wouldn't be so frustrated because, quite frankly, I feel that I put in... I, I feel like I try with this, okay? At the very least, I feel like I do try. So to have that taken away out of something, you know, totally out of my hands, it was frustrating. It was very, very upsetting. It was very upsetting, especially having 
been trying to be a little bit more consistent recently, trying to actually stick with somewhat of a consistent upload schedule, and to have all of that just thrown away. I, I was pissed, bottom line. I was very upset. And yes, I'm aware that that's not exactly the, uh, the classiest of all responses possible, but it is the direction that I went. Uh, one way or another, that's kind of how it went down, as I'm sure you guys are aware. And I, I did want to be clear about that because, again, just because of all the support you guys have given me, all the love you guys have shown me, I feel like I, I feel like the least that I can do is at least be upfront about what happened and why. Uh, if I had to pick one exact moment that sort of set this off, though, it, it would probably be the timing because the timing on this could not have been any worse <laughs> if it were planned out by some sort of divine being. It, it was essentially a choice between. Uh, like holiday obligations or buy myself a new hard drive and I, I don't want to I, I didn't want to downgrade because that didn't really make a lot of sense to me you know being that as is I already tend to fill my hard drive pretty quickly these these videos do take up a lot of space before they get rendered and uploaded and all that good stuff so I, I getting a smaller one didn't make a whole lot of sense to me so honestly the only thing I could do logically in my mind was wait and that is exactly what I did uh, I I think I would do it again, honestly. Uh, I, I, of course, regret not being more clear about that, but I, I, I don't know, this is... I, I just wouldn't have felt right, you know? <laughs> that time of year spending all that money on myself and then having to turn around and say, oh, nope, I didn't have anything for you, I had to spend it on me. You know, that just, uh, just kind of scummy. I hope you guys sort of understand where I'm coming from with that. <laughs> uh, that said... I would expect an ETA for the next videos, like, next week, I would say. Uh, I, I have a hard drive coming in, so uh, that's great. <laughs> that is just fantastic. So that part is taken care of. The reason I don't want to start throwing them up this week is because I don't know how YouTube works anymore. <laughs> because it changes every five minutes, I swear on my life. So the logic behind that is I put this up today, people can see it, and then not be totally blindsided and have, like, five parts to catch up on because they weren't expecting me to start uploading again. You know, it just, it, it makes more sense to me that way. I don't know. It's also a lot of the reason you're seeing the gameplay that you are because I, I have nothing else that I can record, man. Uh, my computer that I'm using to upload this, not a chance. No way in hell. I would be shocked if I could even run, like, Visual Boy events and recording software simultaneously. It's just not gonna happen. <laughs> so here's what you get. Hopefully it's enough of a visual spectacle for you. I know it was for me. And you know, if I'm gonna be honest, I mean, <laughs> I'm not gonna bullshit you guys. I was definitely playing this game for like the last three weeks or so. <laughs> it just consumed my life. And I, I didn't really want to start back because I knew that if I did, I would only be thinking about playing this, <laughs> which would 100% have been the case. Now guys, <laughs> I don't know if I've really mentioned this before, but Kingdom Hearts, one of my favorite series of all times. Easily, easily top three, at the bare minimum. I mean, I've been playing these games since like 2003. I remember like, I, I remember when Kingdom Hearts 1 was the only game in the series, and now there's like 10 of these games. <laughs> Number two was such a huge part of my childhood. I played it so many times. I even tried playing it in like a sort of pseudo challenge thing because uh, the original version of the game was very, very easy, so. I ended up playing through it again like two or three times a summer, doing like low level challenges, trying to do everything possible in the game, get all items, do everything possible, like I I spent so many hours on that game guys, so many hours, well over a hundred for a single player game which is just <laughs> ridiculous when you stop and think about it because that game's not really that long, <laughs> can be knocked down in a few hours if you know what you're doing, now I'm just kind of rambling about it, but uh, <laughs> I love this series. Number three was no exception. I like, like, wow. <laughs> this was a roller coaster of a game, man. Uh, I, I really know that's not the point of this video, but I, I, I kind of hope that I'm proving my point. If anything, that uh, this, this, this is a series that meant a lot to me. So, to not spend any time on a game I've been waiting for for 13 years, yeah, that wasn't gonna happen. And yes, I know it's a meme. It did not take 13 years to make this game. I'm well aware. But goddamn it, it has been 13 years since the last time they put one of these on a real console, and I'm gonna enjoy it for what I can, goddammit. <laughs> Seriously, fact is, it took me like 20 minutes to actually start playing this game the first time I put it in my PS4. So, imagine that. Imagine that for a second, if you will. Waiting 13 years for a game and then spending 20 minutes on the title screen. But that's just the kind of thing this game does to me, man. I don't know why. I don't have an explanation for it. But 
I think I've uh, started to go outside the scope of this video a little bit, so I am going to wrap things up. Thank you for watching this far. If you indeed have, and I will catch you guys when I catch you, uh, most likely sometime next week. See you then. Peace.